It's not $3,000 a person. It's not $1,500 a person. It's not $1,200 a person. Okay, it's not taken to a private platform, so I can charge all this money. So if I get 20,000 people to sign up at $3,000 a piece, let me do the math. 20,000 people times $3,000 a piece. Yeah, we're not gonna do that. It's free, it's free, okay? But you need a book, really important, okay? So get it free at the library, or it's on sale right now at amazon.com US. 51% off, $16.99, 51% off. The anti-bug cleanse is in here. This is the pre-cleanse, so I'm talking about today. The pre-cleanse, right? Making some hot spiced apple juice. I'm gonna make some more in a little bit, so I'm excited, you guys. Glad you guys are here. So make sure you're ready for this, okay? Because we're gonna be having some fun. Anti-bug cleanse is about cleaning up the bugs inside your body Everybody has bugs. Everybody has a bug or two or 10 or 20 or more. A lot of people have different varieties of bugs inside of them. So it's important to know, right? So keep that in mind. And you know, bugs are in people. Viruses are in people. They're in people, right? Okay, bacteria is in people. We have a lot of stuff inside of us, okay? You guys, just before we go any further, I'm doing an exclusive live at 6.15 Eastern, 3.15 Pacific time on Rumble. So I'm doing an exclusive live on Rumble. So find me on Rumble, subscribe, rumble.com forward slash medical medium. And I'm doing an exclusive live. It's not gonna be about the anti-bug cleanse that's coming on the next three days we're doing the anti-bug cleanse. It's gonna be something different. It's an exclusive live I'm gonna be doing on Rumble exactly 6.15 Eastern, okay, 3.15 Pacific. So be there, you know, we'll hang out. We'll talk about some stuff, so I'm excited. It's gonna be a little different. So the anti-bug cleanse is really a step about empowerment, taking control over your life because bugs take control of us. You head into the doctor, you got your Hashimoto's thyroiditis, do you got your hypothyroidism? Do you have to get your thyroid checked? Do you have to go and get your blood work and get your thyroid check checked? That's bugs controlling your life. And then Big Pharma controls your life. Bugs control your life first. Big Pharma controls your life second. Keep that in mind, okay? Because bugs create Hashimoto's thyroiditis, hyperthyroidism, nodules and cysts on your thyroid. That's just the thyroid problems we're just covering right now. We're not even covering eczema, psoriasis, vitiligo, or anything else. Bugs actually control your life, and then you head to the doctor, and then the doctors control your life after that. And then the medications control your life. So you lose your empowerment big time. That's what bugs do. That's what bugs do, okay? So the reason why we're doing the anti-bug cleanse and the reason why it's in this killer book, all right, is to get the bugs out so you can do some healing and move forward, all right? So 51% off amazon.com US, right? $16.99. Don't miss out on that or get it at the library for free. The cleanse is free. Today is just the pre-cleanse. If you guys just came on, watch this from the beginning. It's the pre-cleanse. So we're gonna talk about four categories of food to avoid. Four categories of food to avoid, okay? One is bug fuel. That's one category. Bug fuel. Foods that feed the bug so you stay sick with your lupus, MS, eczema, psoriasis, vitiligo, rosacea, styes, UTIs, chronic sinusitis, lung infections, bronchitis, headaches, colds, flus, anything else, plague, or whatever that's plaguing you, okay? The first category is bug fuel. Removing foods that feeds the bugs, okay? Second category, blood fuel. Thickeners, blood thickeners, removing the blood thickeners, right? The pork, removing the blood thickeners. That's the next category, removing the blood thickeners, right? Okay, 
Removing the bacon, the blood thickeners. That's the second category. This is going to be really fun if you guys want to do it with me, right? Third category, dehydrators. Foods that dehydrate you. The vinegars. Foods that dehydrate you, the vinegars. Removing the vinegars. That's just one thing right there. The dehydrators. Removing the caffeine. Removing the right the vinegars the dehydrators and then removing the toxic contributors nutritional yeast anybody toxic toxic contributors to you getting sick immune system breaker downers like nutritional yeast immune system busters these hurt the immune system right so okay so that's the four categories all right, you like the shirt change, Victoria? <laughs> changed up, changed up. I'm making hot, spicy apple juice. I'm gonna do a little bit. What the heck? I can't even get this going. Well, I don't have any bugs. No, I don't have any bugs. No, no way, I don't need to do this cleanse, no. Fever blister? Yeah, I get one once a year. That's a bug? Well, what is it? The herpes simplex one? Okay, all right. Okay, I didn't know I had a bug. Fever blister, it's a cold source, so that's a bug. I didn't know I had a bug. So it lives inside of where? It lives inside my trigeminal nerve? What, it gives me TMJ in the future, so I'm gonna have TMJ down the road because of my fever blisters? Whoa, wait a minute, that's why I have teeth grinding? Is from the Simplex One, the fever blister? I didn't know that. But I, I, don't, I still don't believe you, I don't have any bugs. This is, this is bull. UTIs? Yeah, I get UTIs every now and then. Yeah, I've been to the urologist. That's a bug? Really? What is that? Streptococcus? Okay, um, vertigo? Yeah, I got dizzy one time and it was unexplained. They didn't know what it was. That's a bug? Wait, my hypothyroid's a bug? You mean my hypothyroid that I go to the doctor and get the numbers checked? That's a bug? So I have, what? Yeah, no, I got patches of eczema. Yeah, I got patches of eczema. Yeah, I do. I got patches of eczema. That's a bug too? My God, I didn't know I had all these bugs. You guys, everybody's walking around with all the bugs. This is the anti-bug cleanse. This is the pre-cleanse. Preliminary, the cleanse starts tomorrow, okay? Long haul COVID, long haul plague, right? Epstein-Barr virus, that's medical medium information. So just so you know, published first by medical medium books, put out there, and then taken by doctors, and that's what you hear out there. So whenever you hear a podcast doctor talk about long haul, that you know, and it being with being viruses that creep up like Epstein-Barr, reactivated Epstein-Barr, reactivated shingles, that is medical medium information. Believe it or not, whether you like it or not, it's published medical medium information first and taken, taken from medical medium and put out there, whether anybody realizes it or not. We're starving the bugs. Yes, we're starving the bugs. So the bugs die off. So you start cleaning up. Important to know. So level one, let me give you an example about level one, you guys. Before we even go there, make sure you prepare yourself. Make sure you prepare yourself recipe-wise. I'm making potato salad tomorrow. Tomorrow's the first day of the anti-book cleanse and I'm making potato salad, so don't miss this. If you guys just came on IG right now, make sure you watch this video from the beginning. If you guys just came on TikTok, Telegram, make sure you watch it from the beginning. Okay, all right, so potato salad day one, making that tomorrow, that's exciting. Day two is portobello stew. Look for the ingredients, get your book so you can get the ingredients. So you see all the ingredient list on the side here? You see all this, ingredients? So I wanna do it with you guys. I wanna actually make the recipe with you guys tomorrow, the next day, and the day after that. So I can't wait to do that. So there's the portobello stew. Because we're going to be doing it. Are you guys pumped up or what? And I'm still in the recipe section right here. 
There's over 75 recipes in here. You wanna do another recipe? Do a different recipe. You wanna do another recipe from this book? Do another one. I'm gonna be making on day three the potato and herb stuffed peppers on day three on the anti-bug cleanse. Will you guys make it with me? Will you guys get the ingredients? Do you have the book? Are you guys gonna be all set or what? Can't wait, if you guys just came on here, 51% off amazon.com, $16.99, it's a medical textbook. It's got the anti-bug cleanse in there, a lot of other things too, over 200 symptoms and conditions. This book has already saved lives around the world. It's already got the street cred. Health books don't save lives. They're not, li they, they don't have a record of saving lives. This already has a record of that. The medical medium book series has a record of saving lives. So when you look at different like podcast doctors or looking at different people that have books, that's great. But guess what? This book has saved thousands upon thousands of lives around the world into the millions now all these years. So bringing people's lives back, giving them answers, that's how you save their life. You get the, the answers you need and you know how to move forward and heal. So this book right here, get it free at the library if you want to. If you guys just came on here, the Medical Medium Anti-Bug Cleanse is free. This is a preliminary day, the pre-cleanse. We're doing three days of anti-bug cleanse and it's free. There's no charge. That's what's incredible. If you just want to hang out, don't even want to do any of it, hang out. So um, you can learn all this different information in here. We're going to level diff different levels. We're talking about that right now. So I'm going to read page 172 right here. Informed decisions right here, okay? All right? If you have a negative association with removing foods from your diet because of a past diet protocol out there where food was eliminated, like food allergy, food allergy elimination, right? Food sensitivity elimination, right? All the different foods. Oxalate elimination foods, right? Blood type elimination foods, oxalates, Lectin elimination foods, right? So if you've had already experiences, like negative, negative experiences with all the different diets, HCG diets, where they starve you in 500 calories a day and you inject yourself with hormone and then you just eventually kill your liver and get sick. Like if you have negative associations of all the bad diets out there, know that this is an entirely different thing and this is very important, okay? Please know that those were and are man-made programs. So those were all man-made programs. Your HCG stuff, man-made programs, right? Your food allergy diets, man-made, your, your AIP, man-made programs. All man-made diet programs, not designed to save lives. Keep in mind, the makers of those programs are unaware of what causes your chronic illness. They don't know why you're sick. Why do you think they took information just recently, like the long haul information about the plague right now? You got long haul COVID, well, it's reactivated Epstein-Barr. Oh, they got that from medical medium, see? Because that's what it is. The, the information's not out there. It comes from here, it comes from the books, right? Just like pesticides linked to Parkinson's. That's medical medium information for decades. And then, now there's a lawsuit about Parkinson's being linked to pesticides. Meanwhile, they got that information from medical medium. That's how they learn and they can do things. Like they can go, we can sue pesticide companies now because we took medical medium's information, he taught for years, the pesticides have the metals, that causes the Parkinson's, now we have some place to go and we have some place to look. Important to know. And they talked about reactivated EBV. So please know, the makers are unaware of what causes chronic illness out there on all those different diet guessing games, right? So that's important to know. Those are guessing games that we don't play here. So we don't play guessing games here. The reason why people get better with medical medium books and medical medium protocols is because the guessing game is taken out. It's completely taken out. Really important to know, right? So only here will you find food empowerment and the ability to take control of your healing process using real knowledge. So Elizabeth, Caitlin says, everyone's going on about air fresheners and forever chemicals now. 
should have listened to AW. That's medical medium information about those. So it's the medical medium podcast blew up everything about that stuff, right? And we know about the air fresheners. Remember killing, killing you smelly, the medical medium podcast and Apple podcast. Um, the, Countless people listen to that episode and then years of lectures, years of the books and putting it in the books, right? And now they're talking about it now. So what it is, is there's no new or original information in alternative medicine. You can link back all the stuff back to medical medium all the way back, okay? And we're actually, we're actually going to be building like this library, li li library of, of information of how and show how much in the health movement is medical medium and originates back to medical medium and it's going to blow the roof and also just it's going to showcase and all the frauds out there it's going to be unbelievable like all the different podcast doctors all the different people who have taken the information from medical medium they didn't take it from science they didn't take it from science or studies they took it from medical medium and it's gonna showcase all of it, including weight gain with the liver, how your liver causes weight gain, medical medium information, and now doctors have taken that, and they're used selling all these products, right? Talking about the air fresheners and what it causes, skin problems being linked to toxic heavy metals, that's medical medium, reactivated Epstein-Barr medical medium all these years, right? Skin conditions caused by your liver, that's medical medium, digestive problems, all of it, like you name it. So yeah, we're going back, <laughs> we're going a little off course right now. But the point is, is if you wonder, well, what do I do? Do I do this new anti-bug cleanse because I've done other things and I got a negative you know, thing about other things? No, this is different. It's not man-made, that's why. The information works and it has a history of working, okay? So over 200 symptoms and conditions, it's a medical textbook. Have it ready for the anti-bug cleanse. It starts tomorrow is day one. We're starting with the potato salad. I'm gonna be, be making the potato salad. I hope you guys make the potato salad with me. I'm gonna be sipping the spiced apple juice every single day. We're gonna be doing the anti-bug cleanse. <laughs> I'm pumped up about it. Where do you get the book for free? Where do you get the cleanse for free? You could go to the library, take the book out, or just go to Amazon.com if you want a 51% off. It's $16.99 at Amazon.com US. All right, so <laughs> we go back to this a little bit. I recommend that you consider shifting your thinking from not being allowed to eat certain items to choosing to eat certain items. So I'd rather have you guys say, you know what? I'm choosing to do this anti-bug cleanse. You know what? I'm choosing to use the foods that are gonna heal me. I'd rather have you guys be like, you know what? I'm gonna choose. I'm gonna choose that food because I, you know what? I wanna do some healing. You guys are allowed to do anything. You guys are allowed to do anything. You guys are allowed to, you guys are allowed to have a greasy double cheeseburger. You're allowed to have a greasy double dough. You're not, not on the anti-bug cleanse. But you're allowed to have anything you want if you're in your own free will. You want to go down the road and you want to get a double bacon cheeseburger. You can get a double bacon cheeseburger. That's your choice. It's your free will. It's your freedom. You can eat what you want, right? You want to eat something, right? You guys want to eat anything you want. Yeah, you guys want to have a pizza? You guys can have a cheese pizza if that's what you guys want to do. But I'm hoping you guys choose to do the anti-bug so you can get rid of the bugs because your bugs are trained to tell you to go and eat this all the time. Guess who's talking to you? The bugs. They're actually talking to you. The bugs. When they're in your body, they're hungry. They're like, feed me, feed me. The bugs are saying like, feed me, feed me. I got my Epstein bars in here causing fibro. I got my Simplex causing fever blisters. I got my Streptococcus causing SIBO. I got my Streptococcus causing UTIs. Feed me, feed me. Bugs say feed me. And then they make you, they make you go and get the food. So the bugs, run your life and then the doctors run your life then big pharma runs your life right so you guys got your own free will you can break it 
And then you can break the addictions of all the chemicals in those foods. All of it. You can break it. You can break away from all the heavy fat for a little while. You can break away. You guys can come out of it. Right? Big, big, you know, big hugs, hugs back to Argentina. Glad you're here. Right? So that's what's incredible. That's empowerment. And when you do something good for yourself, when you're like, you know what? I'm going to take control. I'm going to take a look at this cleanse. The book's on sale. I could also get it free at the library. I'm going to turn my life around. I'm going to turn my life around. And I'm going to, I'm going to choose. I'm going to choose to knock out the bugs. You know that insatiable hunger? You know when you just start gobbling down those cookies? Do you guys know when you just can't help it and you start gobbling down those cookies? Someone's got a plate of cookies and you're like, you know what? I'll do my diet tomorrow. I just want those cookies now. You know who's talking to you? Guess who's talking to you? Guess who's driving you? Your bugs. You know where you can't help it? You're like, I gotta have that ice cream. You know what? I gotta have that bowl of ice cream at night. No, no. I have to have that bowl of ice cream. I gotta have that ice cream tonight. I have to. I have to. You know who's talking to you? You get this little guy right here. This bacteria. You just ordered the book, Noli? Amazing. Amazing. So happy you did. So happy. Okay? And that's what's talking to you. You got to have your ice cream, right? Health of Liz, that was you at one point? Really? Health of Liz, man, she's just like, she's, you're hardcore. You do medical medium foods. Like, my God, really, nobody does out there. It's incredible. Um, Look, that's what talks to us. That's what talks to us. So when you want that ice cream and you want, you want that popcorn, you guys want that big bowl of popcorn? You know what? I, I, you know what? Do I have any popcorn? Hold on, I think I'm gonna look for some popcorn for a second. I think I got some popcorn. Let me see. Let me see. You guys, what happens when? I mean, what? You guys want some popcorn? I just, I just had this. I just ordered it from a popcorn place. You guys want some popcorn? What happens? I just have to have my popcorn. I have to have it every day. You want your organic popcorn? You want to pop your organic popcorn at night? Right? Your organic popcorn? Guess who's talking to you? Guess who's making you pop the popcorn? Right here. The bugs are making you pop the popcorn. That's what makes you shove popcorn down your throat. And you can't help it. And you want butter on the Oh no, I use coconut oil on my popcorn. I'm doing myself such I'm doing myself real good. I'm using coconut oil. I'm outsmarting everybody. <laughs> I'm using coconut oil on my popcorn. I'm gonna outsmart everybody. You're not outsmarting anybody because that popcorn's still going down the gullet. The bugs eat the corn. Cold white spring. <laughs> Uh, I'll let you, you know what, eventually I'll tell you guys the origin of popcorn. It's unbelievable. It's, it's a hor horrifying story. I actually, I'm going to have to tell it on a podcast, actually, when I do tell it, because it's the most horrible thing you've ever wanted to know. It's just terrifying, actually. The story of how popcorn started. It's, it's, it's so, it's so, it's bloody gory, actually. You wouldn't even believe it. No one would touch popcorn again after they hear that story. <laughs> Did I throw a zinger at you guys? So the bugs tell you to have your popcorn, and that's what it is, you know? They just tell you to have that popcorn. God's sitting there, I'm, I'm gonna have some more popcorn. Honey, it's organic, did you get the organic popcorn? Yeah, it's organic, okay, then it's fine. Did you put coconut oil on it? Yeah, I put coconut oil. I didn't put butter on it. Okay, yeah, yeah, I don't wanna have butter tonight, good. Right? When you starve the bugs, but you don't starve your organs and you don't starve your body you take control over your life and you move forward and you move forward and you do some healing and you do some healing yeah you do you do some healing it's amazing so you guys we're on preliminary prep this is prep day for the anti-bug cleanse if you just got here on ig on telegram tiktok Watch it from the start, important information. I'm gonna be making some spicy apple juice. You could sip on that throughout the whole cleanse. Gonna make that in a little bit. 
But let's just run down a little bit on the level five levels here. Spicy apple juice, right? So let's keep on going a little bit more, okay? This, is a li this list is here so you can make informed decisions about what foods they prevent you from experiencing the health that you deserve. So these bad foods, these toxic foods, stop you from experiencing good health is what that means. Quick announcement, everybody's here right now? Quick announcement. After this live, at 6.15 Eastern, 3.15 Pacific, I'm gonna be on Rumble, just Rumble. We're not gonna talk about the anti bug cleanse. We're gonna talk about other stuff. And I'm gonna be just on Rumble. So you can find me at rumble.com forward slash medical medium, okay? Subscribe because Rumble is where medical medium is gonna be doing a lot of the you know, intense stuff along the ways and other stuff too, all kinds of stuff. Yeah. <laughs> so let's go into this a little bit more, right? This is important here, right here. Let's also be clear. Let's also be clear that none of the foods here are listed as problematic out of prejudice. This isn't about being prejudiced against dietary belief systems such as vegan, such as plant-based, such as paleo, such as ketogenic, such as vegetarian, such as any of that. This isn't about being prejudiced, okay, about any of it, nor is this cleanse about self-deprivation. So if you're somebody that loves, you love the keto thing and you love the plant-based thing, you're like, wait a minute, is this whole thing gonna be against me? Is it, wait a minute, your animal protein base, is this whole thing going to be? No, it has nothing to do with any of that. Really important to know, okay? The foods are listed solely because they pose the risk that you will not succeed. That you will not succeed with your cleansing and healing process. It's about the foods that pose a risk to stop you from succeeding so you don't heal. You know, people don't want to heal. That's what I've heard out there. You know, people don't want to heal. It's like, I've heard that, you know, someone's sick and they're trying to find an answer and they can't find the answer and they're still sick and they're going to a doctor and then a psychiatrist and then a healer. And the healer says, or the doctor says, you just don't want to heal. That's what your real problem is. You know, something happened to you in a past life and you just don't, you have a fear of healing because your head was chopped off during Queen Victoria's time and then you just don't want to heal. And that's why you can't get rid of these lesions or you can't get rid of this, the, the skin problem or the eczema, the psoriasis, or you can't get rid of the fatigue. You just don't want to heal. I heard that out there, but I don't believe that. Everybody wants to heal. Everybody in their soul, deep down inside, wants to heal. So why is it we self-sabotage ourselves so bad? Why is it, you guys, we sabotage ourselves? Why is it? Why is it we sabotage ourselves, you guys? Why is it that we sabotage ourselves? Oh, what? What, is that why? Is that why? You mean bugs that want to eat the food? They want to eat the food? So when this food goes inside of me, you just want to eat it? So you're going to make sure when you guys get hungry, you're going to control me and make me actually eat it. That's why. That's why. Okay? It's not that someone doesn't want to heal. It's not that someone is weak and they don't want to heal and they have a fear of healing it's because there's something inside of them that wants to eat something bad and it wants to eat it real real bad and it wants to eat it and guess what you better be shoving those eggs down your throat because those bugs are going to need them and once you start taking that stuff away your bugs they start to starve and get hungry That's how it works. Let's make some apple juice. Spicy hot apple juice. 
Let's do that, you guys, okay? So, getting the juicer out. Make a little apple juice, okay? I'm gonna cut up some apples really quick. So we have to realize something. This isn't you talking when you want that popcorn. This isn't you talking when you want those cheesy eggs, those omelets with cheese. This isn't you talking when you want that bacon, salty bacon, fatty bacon. This isn't you talking when you want that double cheeseburger. This isn't you talking when you want that cheesy bean burrito with that fake vegan cheese. It's not you talking. There's stuff in all of this that feeds the bugs because you're loaded with bugs. Everybody has the bugs. That's right. Yeah, so many people didn't believe me all these years until the plague happened, until the plague came around and everybody scared shit about the plague. So much so, they're just, their whole lives are being just twisted upside down because they're scared to death of the bug going around. But medical means been talking about viruses for 35 plus years and people were like, what? What? What are you talking about? People just have a fear of healing. There's no bugs. Nobody even thought. There's, there's, there's guys out there putting books out, doctors putting books out. They're all their whole year, all their years of work were just food science. They didn't even know bugs existed. They were just talking about What's good for you? Omega-3s are good for you. Probiotics are good for you. They had no idea why anybody was sick. And then the plague came around, right? The plague came around and they're like, viruses, viruses? Wait a minute, medical medium talked about viruses for all these years and we didn't even do what? Everybody's got the bugs in them. They do. You got the Epstein-Barr. Some people have three or four. If you've ever been on the dating scene, the dating scene, okay? You can pick up two, three Epstein bars and they can sit dormant in you until they pop out and give you vertigo and make you sick. That's just life. Oh, I'm dating this person here. I'm dating this person here. Oh no, I dated a few people last year. I'm dating a few more people last year. We gotta clean those bugs up. Streptococcus, two, three varieties of strep, and then you get your strep throat once in a while, then you get your UTIs, and then now you got fatigue, and now you got thyroiditis, all those Epstein bars we collect. That's the process of life. Well, I'm eating at restaurants all the time. I mean, how many? Ooh, just cut my finger. I just cut my finger, but you know what? You guys are gonna be drinking this apple juice with me, right? You don't mind if I drop blood in here? Should I get a band aid? Because I'm a chef. I just cut my finger, so I'm gonna, uh, you know what? I'm just gonna throw a quick Band-Aid on here and still make your apple apple juice because are you in my restaurant right now? You guys, I'm gonna serve you some apple juice. Hold on, I'm gonna put a Band-Aid on my finger. Do I have Epstein Bar? I don't know, I'm just a chef that has thousand tattoos on me. And you know, who knows what I, yeah, I dated a few people last year and I've had I've been in the tattoo parlor a million times getting ink everywhere. With, with dirty, dirty ink guns because they don't tell you how much blood gets smeared on the ink guns and how they're not always sterile. But you know what? I can still make your apple. Do you guys don't mind if I got a little blood on my finger here like in the restaurants, all the chefs cut themselves? You guys don't remind, right? You guys eat blood all the time in the restaurants and don't even know it. Listen, you don't have to worry about all my bugs. Let me just, I'm gonna put a Band-Aid on here. You guys can still have some, right? You guys. Everybody's got, but I'm not cut by the way. Any, everybody's got the bugs. Right? Let's do a little, uh, little apple juice here. Let's make a little, so you guys, by the way, before I go off track, make sure you have a copy of Cleanse to Heal, 51% off Amazon.com, US, take advantage of it, it costs more to print it, so you're, you're actually like, it's a killing, it costs more to print the book, it's a medical textbook, 200 symptoms and conditions, 75 recipes, and we're doing the anti-bug cleanse, it's the next three days, this is the pre-anti-bug cleanse. Next three days, we're doing the anti-bug cleanse. The recipes I'm gonna do in here, I'm really excited about. I wanna do them with you. This is gonna be so great.
Amira said, Anthony, you're a great actor. That's funny. How much is it in the UK? I know, I know Book Depository, I think it's on sale. I just don't know how much, how much it is, but I think it's on sale. Amazon too. Book, de de book Depository, I'm pretty sure it's on sale at Book Depository. See guys, I'm doing a little juicing right now. I'm, I'm juicing some fresh apples. You can put apple juice in your apple, spiced apple juice. You can use apple juice, right? So you can do you can do a clean organic apple juice, a clean one doesn't have citric acid, doesn't have natural flavors. Anybody who's watched this, you should if you just got on, you should watch this from the beginning. Chelsea Field, dear friend of mine, close close friend, Scott Bakula, Chelsea Field. Those those are amazing actors. I'm not. <laughs> Those guys are amazing actors. What is the other website called from the UK? Book Depository? So making some apple juice, right? So you can you can find yourself I'm doing like I'm doing fresh apple juice for this, which is incredible. This is the hot spiced apple juice I'm making. I have it in the pot right now, a little bit in there. I'm gonna add more to it. I'm gonna put some cinnamon sticks. Right? I'm doing fresh, fresh, I'm um, juicing fresh apples right now. Right? So listen, 16 ounces of celery juice every morning. If you're already doing 32 ounces of celery juice, do 32 ounces. This is the basics of the cleanse, the anti-bug cleanse, just getting you guys prepped and ready. Keep out troublemaker foods in whatever level you pick. Keep the troublemaker foods out. Drink at least 32 ounces to a liter of water during the day. You can sip coconut water if you want all day long. You can drink coconut water. Don't drink red or pink coconut water. It's spoiled. It's... it's um, it's oxidated, it's spoiled, it's bad, so don't do that. So I'm juicing some apple juice right here, you guys, okay? Move this over. I'm gonna put some fresh apple juice right in here. There we go, amazing, okay? It's a trick to sell coconut water because when it's pink and red, it's gone bad, but the companies can't lose $2 million or $3 million in their coconut water buy. So here's how it works. The coconut water company, right? That, you know, the coconut water companies you see out there in Whole Foods and other plate, whatever, when it goes red or pink, it went south, it went bad. But they're gonna lie and tell you that that's the best part, that's the best coconut water. They actually did you in a terrible injustice. Okay, it's rancid coconut water and they're doing that because they'll lose their shirts because when they get the coconut water, they get batches that they don't realize that that went bad, but they don't wanna throw the money away, which could be like millions of dollars. So because in order to save the millions when they got that coconut water, they have to tell you the pink red coconut water is actually good. It's not, it's, the, it's backwards, it's, it's actually bad. I'm letting you know. Learn, learn the tricks out there so you can protect yourself. It's one of the biggest scams out there going. And that's the thing about medical medium information. You guys are going to learn more about alternative medicine and conventional than you've, ever, than you've ever dreamed of. Than you've ever dreamed of. You can also use a clean apple juice in here too. Check this out. Right? Clean apple juice in here. Right? Quick announcement. Quick announcement. Okay, at 6.15 Eastern, I will be on Rumble, but just Rumble. Not gonna be on IG, I'm not gonna be anywhere else, I'm not gonna be on Telegram, I'm not gonna be on TikTok, I'm gonna be on just Rumble. I'm letting you know, it's 3.15 Pacific, 6.15 uh, Eastern, okay? So find me at Rumble, okay? Just letting you know, I'm gonna be live. 
It's going to be an intimate setting in the sense we're just going to be on there. And we're going to talk about something different. We're not going to talk about, it's going to be off topic. We're not going to talk about the anti-bug cleanse that's coming up. So I got this cooking. I'm excited. So let's put some spices in here. Let's put a cinnamon stick in here. Let's get a little cinnamon stick in here, you guys. Mm, mm, mm. Nice little cin cinnamon stick in there. I already have some in there now. I'm going to put a little bit more. Nice little cinnamon stick. I'm going to put some cloves in here, right? Don't use essential oils. Someone asked that before. Don't use essential oils in your apple. <laughs> Don't consume essential oils. They're for the outside of the body. They're for the senses. They're for your infusers. They're for your diffusers. They're for that. They're not for internalizing. You don't internalize essential oils. It was a bad idea. If you're somebody who's sensitive and has any kind of digestive problems or anything else and you're orally taking, internalizing essential oils, man, you're going to have problems over time. I'm going to put some ground nutmeg in here. Essential oils are for like your diffusers. If you want it, the air, smell in the air. And there's people so sensitive, they can't even handle that. That the sensitive, the sensitive to essential oil smells. So to put some ginger in there, too, too much, you know. Let's get the sucker to a boil. All right. So make sure you follow me on Telegram too, because I'm doing exclusive audio messages on Telegram that I'm not doing anywhere else. I'm just letting you know. So on Telegram, make sure you, you follow me on Telegram. Make sure you subscribe so you can hear the exclusive audio messages that I do almost every single day, okay? So it's t.me forward slash medical medium. That's Telegram, right? So let's talk about this cleanse. Let's talk about the anti bug cleanse a little bit. Different levels right here. Level one, medical meeting, cleanse of heal. Level one, keep away eggs, dairy products. So keep away your eggs. Keep away your milk, cheese, and butter. Keep away your milk, cheese, and butter. They feed the bugs. This is level one, anti-bug cleanse. All right? Okay? Yeah, you guys, I'm going to be exclusive there, okay? Keep away gluten. That's another thing to keep away, right? Like, for instance, keep away the grilled cheese sandwiches. Keep away the grilled cheese, okay? When you guys got a hankering for that grilled cheese, right? Guess who's got a hankering for it? The bugs. You guys don't know how much your bugs run your life. How much they actually mind control you and take control over your actions and intentions. They even change your intentions. My intention is to make sure I have another greasy, buttery grilled cheese sandwich. And I'm gonna, I'm intent on having that grilled cheese sandwich today. And um, these guys are talking. These guys are talking. The bugs are talking. Right there. Born to know. Level two, you guys, I'm doing all five levels. I'm doing the, all the levels. I'm going level five. I'm just going right to level five. That's what I'm doing. You can do level one. You can do level two. Level two is pork, right? Stay away from the pork. <laughs> Stay away from the bacon and the pork. Bacon, see the bacon strips in there? That's level two. Stay away. What about vegan cheese? Vegan cheese moves you down to staying away from other things. So what you do is, what's your vegan cheese made out of? That's the key. Is your vegan cheese made out of canola? Is it made out of soy? What's your vegan cheese made out of? Because that's level five. That gets rid of things like the vegan cheeses and stuff. Preservatives, chemicals in vegan cheese, natural flavors in vegan cheese. There's all kinds of stuff in vegan cheese. Vegan cheese can be just as bad as regular cheese. Can be just as bad. So be careful on there. Anita, level five as well. Level five. Remember the four categories, okay? This is pumping right now. The four categories, 
Bug fuel, that's one category, we're getting rid of those. Blood thickeners, we're getting rid of those. Dehydrators, body dehydrators are getting rid of those and toxin contributors. So now level three gets rid of soy, lamb, corn, tuna, pork, soft drinks, gluten, dairy, eggs, milk, cheese, butter. It's level three. Level four, all the above that I just said, plus vinegar, fermented foods, caffeine, coffee, matcha, chocolate. That's level four. Can you guys handle it? Can you do it? Level five, absolutely. Tedama. Level five. Level five is all of the above plus grains. Grains. Okay? Including healthy fats. Level five is including getting rid of healthy fats. Coconut, sesame, avocado, grapeseed, almond, macadamia nut, peanut butter, sunflower, walnut, olive, flax. But you can keep millet and oats on level five. Level five only, Christine? Are you serious? Level five? Are you you guys are you guys doing level five? Are you guys you guys are freaking me out? <laughs> you guys are blowing my mind right now. If I was an emoji, if I was a mind blowing emoji, I'd be like. Like that, like a mind blowing emoji. Level five means all levels at once. You guys are doing level five. Listen, it's okay to do level one if someone wants to do level one. It's okay to do level two, level three. Don't worry. If you don't even want to do any of those, just be there. As long as you're there, I'm happy. Because something might catch on. Like catch on. You might be like, you know what? I'm doing something. Level five, and my stomach is so much better. Whoa, Kika Severo. Cool, cool name too, man, Kika Severo. Yeah. Guys, I'm gonna, I'm gonna strain this right now. If you just came on, if you just came on, make sure 51% off, $16.99, Amazon.com. It's 51% off, it costs more to actually print the book it's a medical textbook, 75 recipes. The recipes that we're doing are in here. You guys, you guys, seriously. We're doing the potato salad tomorrow. I'm making it. Are you making it with me? Make sure you have the ingredients. Make sure you have the ingredients. Portobello stew is the next day. This is just the beginning, man. We're just, we're just doing the, the preliminary. You know, if you're really struggling, you can do less. If you're struggling, you could do more. You can do whatever you like. You can combine other medical medium cleanses if you want. If you want to combine, if you want to do the mono cleanse or combine it, combine, combine it. You can do medical medium tools too if you're really struggling. Portobello stew. Okay, you guys, day three is potato and herb stuffed peppers, day three. You guys, so many of you guys are doing level five, I can't even believe it. I'm an emoji, can't even believe it. You guys, level five, I can't even believe it. My head just exploding, like I'm exploding, level five. All right, I promised, I promised, uh, Members of the medical meeting team, I would keep it together today and and can just talk information and not fool around too much. So I'm sorry if I'm getting, sorry if I'm getting a little out of hand, you guys. It's just that I have to be honest about something. I drank all that spicy apple juice from the last live, and I am pumped right now. So I'm gonna. So I'm just telling you right now that. That fresh, hot, spicy apple juice that I'm making is so good that for some reason, I'm getting so much glucose to the brain that I'm like happy. So anyway, look, I'm on, somebody asked what level is medical medium on? I'm on level five, man. Level five. And plus bonus, dude, dude. I'm level five plus bonus. Look in there. There's even bonus. 
Where is it? Okay, I'm level five, and check this out. No alcohol, no, this is the bonus. I'm level five, right? Plus, level five is no caffeine. Dude, I got no caffeine in me. I don't use caffeine. You crazy? I don't want to burn out my neurotransmitters and die an early death down the road. No. If I'm going to die, it's because some other reason. Someone's probably going to just, you know, take me out from pissing off everybody for too long. Fate says, what page? I'm on 171. So, if I'm going to die, it's from lack of sleep. That's what it is. Because I want to try to work 20 hours a day. Sometimes I try to do 22 hours a day. So if I die early, that's from not sleeping for 35 years of trying to get this work done for you guys to get it out there. Because I'm trying to keep up with all the misinformation out there and trying to constantly debunk it and get you what you need and, and put the books out. Man, I die early, man. It's because of no sleep. Whew. Okay, check this out, all right? <laughs> I'm off topic. So, okay. So, I'm level five, right, on this cleanse. Next three days. Doesn't mean you guys got to do level five. I'm level five, which is no caffeine, no fats. You're totally fat-free. None of the milk, cheese, butter, no pork, no tuna, no corn, no soy, no nothing, right? And then I'm bonus too, right? No alcohol. No natural artificial flavors or natural flavors. No nutritional yeast. Dude, I don't eat nutritional yeast anyway because nutritional yeast is a glutamic acid. Plus, it's really irritating to the central nervous system and it rips apart the intestinal tract too. I wouldn't do nutritional yeast. But I'm no nutritional yeast. I'm no citric acid. I'm no aspartame. I'm no artificial sweeteners. I'm no monosodium glutamate. I'm no MSG. I'm no formaldehyde. I'm no preservatives. Right? I'm no drugs. I'm no ayahuasca. I'm no hallucinogenics. I'm no psychoactive drugs. I'm no microdosing any kind of crap. I'm not doing any shrooms. I'm not doing weed. I'm not smoking pot. I'm not doing marijuana. Are weed, marijuana, and pot the same thing? I'm not doing any of that. I'm not even doing CBD with THC. I'm not doing nothing. I'm level five baby plus bonus. Yeah. And I eat an abundance of healing foods because you can. You, there's so much to eat. Let, let's just do the spicy juice here. You guys, I'm telling the spicy juice kicked in. The spicy apple juice kicked in. And I was just like, yeah. Yeah, man, this is, this is like the real stuff, man. Pass another joint along. Yeah, man. What? Did you say something? Huh? Yeah, what? Why didn't you give me a beer out of the fridge, man? Hey. What, I thought you'd my girlfriend. My girlfriend always gets a beer out of the fridge for me. You don't want to do it tonight? You don't want to get the beer out? I already had two joints. You think it's too much? All right, this is my next round. <laughs> I think we're gonna be in trouble at 6.15 Eastern, 3.15 West Coast time, because I'm gonna be on Rumble by myself. No one's gonna be policing me, and I'm just gonna be on Rumble by myself with you guys. Are you guys coming? All right, enough fooling around. Not fooling around. Um, oh my God, that's so good. Make sure you have your book ready. Tomorrow starts day one of the Medical Medium Anti-Bug Cleanse. It's free. There's no charge. I could take it to a private platform and charge $1,500 a, a, a pop for a ticket. And I'm not going to do it. I'm not gonna do it. I don't care if that would equal $3.5 million. I'm not gonna do it. I'm doing it for free. I know you guys appreciate it. How do I find you on Rumble? Medical Medium or Rumble? Yeah. It's, it's uh, rumble.com forward slash medical medium. Link is in description. 
51% off, $16.99. Okay? Yep. Make sure you guys got the book. Start the anti-bug cleanse with me. I was trying to read some comments. And you can be sipping this all day during the cleanse if you want. I'm, I'm going to be sipping it. Love and Healing, I'm working on the book. I'm trying to finalize the, the book to, to get it to the publisher. I am. I'm trying my best. But I feel like I got to also make sure I'm doing things to keep you guys, you know, also inspired. This is, you know, I was doing the anti-bug cleanse level five. So it's like, I, I'm inspired. I wanted to inspire you guys. So I figured, why don't we do a cleanse together? Incredible. So you guys, we have the plan. This is the pre-cleanse day. Tomorrow it starts. I'm going to make the potato salad. You guys can choose any recipes in Cleanse the Heal. You can have any recipes in Cleanse the Heal. You can eat them all day long. Pepper seed, good to see you. Be here live so we can make it together. If you don't have the book or you don't have the recipe or you don't have something, just, it's okay. Just be there. Just learn. Learn. Just know that I care. It's about you guys being there. Okay? Nemo come. You got the canker sores? Man, there's, there's, you can do stuff to get, you, there's stuff to do to clean that up. Canker sore viruses are really annoying. They're really annoying for a lot of people. Nikki, you're the best. Thanks for being here. All you guys. Um, just know that I care, and I will see you at 6.15 Eastern, 3.15 Pacific on Rumble. I'll see you guys there. I might bring my spicy apple juice. I love you guys. Can't wait to see you tomorrow on the anti-bug cleanse too. Okay? Incredible.